Silva is probably in his, uh, in his um, uncle. Just, just on, that, um, on that tackle, you just felt he won the ball fairly and there was no danger? Because Sir Alex said there was danger and he could have caused injury. For me, no. Because if it was danger, also Nani that was there, was the player near the ball, probably said something about this uh, versus the referee. He didn't say nothing. Isn't it a case there that any player who goes in lifts both feet is maybe taking a risk? No, no, no. no. I, in, in 30 years, I have never seen a sending off for a, a tackle like this. I can understand if Nani was inside, uh, okay, but... Uh, is that the danger is that players are going to stop tackling? No, but okay, but sometimes it can happen. But I, I watched also uh, last week, I watched three or four players in Premier League did a tackle Vross than, than, uh, than uh, Vinny. And the, with the same referee, uh, they said they didn't nothing. No yellow card, nothing. If the, um if the FA turn it down, which to be honest they normally do, I think there's only 14 out of 50 yeah. were successful last season. Oh, Is there yeah. anything you can do? I'm or, confident. Or I'm confident because uh, uh, it's correct like this. It's correct. But we've seen others, we saw the Wolves play against Arsenal. He, he, he lost his appeal, everyone was coming to that with him. It's got to be a chance that he wouldn't be successful. I know, but I'm confident for this, for Vinny, because when Vinny threw the ball, was uh, in anticipate, he did enough. So on really the really raising the card, Roberto, you, you, you do that now and again in the dugout, you did it against <laughs> Liverpool. Do you, do you not have a problem with that? No, I, I, yeah, I did. It's good. All the people said, uh, say apologize, apologize, because in England we don't do this. Okay, I say apologize if I did this, but was normal, no? Because uh, five minutes before uh, was a red car, red car for Gareth Barry for nothing. Uh, I don't know. But it's strange because in England, uh, the referee accept uh, incredible tackle at some time, they're sending off uh, for nothing. Uh, this is strange. I don't understand. Is it, in Italy, it's quite normal, is it, to yeah, yeah, people we to have wait cars? Yeah, and no we one, have a, yeah, we are different. No one worries about that? No. I think um, Carl and Cup refer to lots of People in this country don't see it as that important. It clearly, is quite important to you. Can you explain why that why that is? But it is not important. But we are in the in the semi-final now. If we can go in the final, if we win a Carling Cup, is another trophy for us. Uh, we are not United. We are not Chelsea. We need to win uh, everything. If it's possible. You say it's not important, but you you fielded strong teams from the start in this competition. No, we. When we play against Arsenal, we, we change all the players, uh, and uh, and now uh, it's normal. We are the same time. Do you, do you feel a, a pressure from the owners to to deliver, a, to give them a, a, a big shiny trophy every year? No, 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 no. Absolutely. No, they, no. they don't want you to. They don't care whether you win. No, no, no. I think that they are interested in that we win. Uh, Everything, I think that if it's possible, but uh, no, no, I don't have pressure from from them. No, no, absolutely. Yes. Despite the fact it's a trophy, is it, is it almost a burden in a sense with the players you've got out and the fixtures you've got in the, in the Premier League? Is it almost a burden in a way to have these extra games, given the players that are missing? No, no, no. There's no. Maybe is uh, in England is the. The last trophy, Carling Cup, is a normal no? but because before you have a Premier, FA Cup, but where, when you are there, you want to win, <laughs> and uh, it's a normal. And also, if you get a if you get a trophy early in the season, because it would be February, that gives you a lot of confidence to go and get yeah, another yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's another trophy if we. We win this trophy, and it's important for the last three months in the season. If you'd be frustrated that Liverpool played Friday and you played Sunday again, uh, the last time you played, there was a you had less time to recover, didn't you? Is that a problem? For also, you? this I don't understand. After the tackle, I don't understand this. <laughs> if you're, uh, <laughs> you're getting very frustrated with no, 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 no
if you're so short of players, only 19 players, why can you afford to allow Tevez to stay in Argentina effectively on strike? I mean, that, that, if that seems bizarre a, that you can afford uh, to do if that. If Tevez uh, doesn't want to come back... Uh, But you do need you do need strikers, don't you? Why, why can you tolerate that? Okay, but now we are like this. Uh, we should continue like this. We can do nothing also for this uh, situation. Coach, what do you make of uh, Liverpool's approach to their problems they've had with Luis Suarez? They seem to think he's done nothing wrong. No, I think that. Uh, Sometimes can happen on the pitch. Uh, a situation like this uh, is important to 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 ask apologize for what we did because sometimes you on the pitch you can do something that you don't want to do because you are nervous. You are you don't think uh, on the pitch. Uh, but uh, I don't know. I don't think that Suarez is uh, racist. I don't think this. That he, he made a mistake. Probably yes. But I think that is a. You think you say it's important to apologise when you, even if you don't mean it. Everyone can do a mistake sometimes. Everyone. It's impossible that we are always perfect, and uh, it's important that they say, "I am sorry, I made a mistake, apologise for this," and they accept the the charge. If you mean, obviously, playing in Italy, where there uh, have been Maybe. issues in Italy, just like there have been here. Do you ever encounter anything like that in your playing career? No, but sometimes in the last uh, in the last year in Italy, sometimes was happened also this, uh, but uh, difficult in the pitch. Maybe with <coughs> with the supporters, yes, in the pitch sometimes. Sometime. Do you think it was a mistake? <coughs> A lot of controversy about the T-shirts of supporting Suarez. Would you have done that as a <laughs> maybe? Maybe this. Maybe a mistake. Anyone ever insult you, Roberta, on the pitch? <laughs> <laughs> What's the worst thing anyone's ever said to you? <laughs> <laughs> Apart from us, uh, everything. In 20 years, uh, everything. But uh, I understand. I I don't. I didn't cry for. This uh, on the pitch because uh, I repeat, I have my opinion on the pitch can can happen everything because you don't think because you are tired because you are stupid when you are young uh, for many reasons. Uh, but uh, what's the worst thing you've ever said about anybody? On the <laughs> <laughs> Did you say to Trevor Francis? <laughs> no, Trevor Francis uh, was my friend. <laughs> No. <laughs> no, I said something, I said, sure, but uh, not uh, important things like uh, words, uh, racist words, you know. Be nice. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.